27-year-old Russian just limbering up. To the final of the women's 59-kilogram bout. So Lipatova in red for Russia. Devara in blue for Moldova. So Chair Devara Isanu of Moldova represented her country at the Rio Games, an 11th place finish for the former European junior champion. Something that Lipatova has done herself in her career, the 27 year old, the 2013, two years after Isanu. He was also world junior champion in the same calendar year. Very politely informed, Lipatova. She is the passive one. She certainly takes that to heart because she's snuck herself into a scoring opportunity. Uh, Devara Isanu clinging on. Uh, enough to see them called back to their feet. Well, little comments of passivity, but no penalties given against. They certainly both look happy to get through this first round. So 30 seconds against the Moldovan in the final minutes of the first round. Hasn't really changed much in the flow of the opening round. So Lipatova with the point advantage. Devara Isanu penalized for passivity. As mentioned, Isanu competed in Rio. Lipatova hasn't yet been to an Olympic Games, but was a youth Olympic Games bronze medalist in 2010 in Singapore. And it's the Russian who takes a slender lead into the break. A chance to get a breather. Lipatova winning her European silver medal in Bucharest last year to improve on her bronze medal one on home soil in Kaspisk in 2018. She's looking for another successful spell in Serbia. Her European brought silver medal coming three years ago in Novi Sad. So another chance here in Serbia. She will have at least a silver, but can she upgrade to gold? She trails Lipatova by a point. So far, just a year between these former junior international champions. 
Only a passivity point so far, separating them. A shot from Lepatova, shut down by the Moldovan. Certainly fighting in a manner of worrying of what they might lose rather than what they can win. That likely will change as the clock continues to click down. But passivity against Lepatova. Shadavara Isanu knows. She gets that point, she will have the lead by Kratorium. There's a long way still to go. The referees have to be heavily involved. Oh, well, Shedorova Esanu didn't want her back to the Russian. And she does take the point for passivity against Lepatova. And it's now advantage Moldova in the battle for gold. So Lipatova needed to score, but passivity again against Shadavara Isanu. First time he's seen in the World Cup someone be accused of passivity twice. And that really is going to hurt her. Four seconds to score, but with it only being a point, she'll not want to be too desperate and allow Lipatova uh, ability to take advantage. A 2 1 to the Russian in this gold medal matchup. Uh, 59 kilograms into the final 25 seconds. Devara Esanu needs to score, or it's going to be gold for Russia. Russia will get a sixth medal, but will it be a second women's gold? Or will Moldova? get their second golden moment in the women's event in Belgrade. But Lipatova looks to be edging her way to the top of the podium. And that is confirmed by the referee's whistle. Lipatova has a little look round. Not a massive reaction from the 2019 European silver medalist. But it's silver in the end for Moldova. A second gold for Russia. An overall 